Hey, how's it going guys and welcome back. With Pokemon Scarlet and Violet coming out in a few days, I figured why not go over the officially revealed Pokemon roster and sort of give you guys my thoughts regarding their designs because I'm going to be honest, I'm actually very apathetic towards a lot of these. And while I have seen the leaks, which by the way we won't be discussing here, um, when it comes to at least like most of the designs, I'm not particularly liking them. I'm, I'm not really disliking them either. This isn't like a slight to Gen 9 or anything like that. There's just a lot of Pokemon that I'm like either neutral to or I'm just like, eh, whatever. So Sprigatito, Fuecoco, Quaxley, I've never been super into first stages. I, I prefer the beefier final forms of my uh, Pokemon, but they're okay. Like, like, like they're not, they're not a bad roster of uh, starters, but they're definitely not like high tier for me either. Um, the legendaries to me, again, I think the motorcycle gimmick is a little bit, uh, dare I say, gimmicky. And they kind of remind me of, like, side legendaries, like Zapdos, Articuno, Moltres, as opposed to something like, um, a box art legendary, like, you know, the big beefy, uh, Dialga, Palkia, Reshram, Zekrom, like, they, they, they remind me more of side legendaries, but again, I'm, I'm not someone who really cares that much about legendaries, I'm gonna be honest. Um, Emerouge looks okay, he's a little humanoid for my, for my liking, um, and, uh, he reminds me a lot of Mega Man. He's fine, though. I really don't like Belly Bolt. Uh, you guys might disagree with me. You guys might hate me for that. But his face is just straight nightmare fuel. Let's be real. Um, Seru Ledge, he looks pretty dope. He, he, he's pretty humanoid, too, but I can forgive it. Um, Say Titan, this is another one. I, I'm not really vibing with this at all. Like, I don't like its design. I know what it's supposed to be, but he's just... I, I'm not feeling it. Um, Cyclozor is just the legendaries, but smaller. He's actually probably, out of the three of them, I, I, I probably think his design is the best in terms of, like, what it's trying to do. Um, I'm gonna be honest with Farad Giraffe, I don't like his design. I'm very happy that Giraffe Ray got an evolution, but its design looks really derpy. Like, it just looks like it's wearing a Halloween costume. That might have been what they were going for. But I, I, I'm sorry, Farad Giraffe fans. I'm, I'm not a fan personally. Uh, same with Fido. It's cute, but like I don't like I don't like food Pokemon. Like it's cute, I guess. Um, Gimme Goal's okay. I, I saw a lot of people express that they really don't like it. I think it's okay. Um, it's a little silly. We already have Mimic Pokemon. We have Voltorb. We have uh, a Moongus. We have. Uh, I think that's pretty much it. I, I guess you can kind of count Geodude as a mimic because for Rock Smash purposes. But he's okay. I don't mind him. Uh, Grafifi, I think that's a solid design. I think Grafifi, Grafi however the hell you say his name, he's solid. I, I think he looks really cool. Uh, I, I don't know if he evolves. I, I, I can't remember. Uh, whatever his evolution is, I hope it looks cool. Uh, Grievard is okay. Grievard's not like top tier for me. He just looks like a dog with a candle on his head. Uh, hopefully he evolves into something nice. Um, Cloth, I think, looks pretty cool. But they had to put the stupid red things on his cheek. Like, this is the thing when it comes to a lot of Pokemon. Sometimes they look cool, but then they just do one thing that makes it look kind of dumb. Like, um... I, I mean, I guess you could say the whole thing about the terrestrialized mechanic. A lot of people don't like the hats it makes. Like, if they just went crystally, it'd be cooler. But that's an example of that. Cloth, like... Just get rid of the cheeks, and he could just be a normal derpy crab, and he'd be fine. LeChonk looks looks really cool. I, I like what LeChonk looks like. Um, that's all I'm gonna say. LeChonk specifically, I like. <laughs> uh, Paldian Wooper looks pretty cool. I mean, it's just Wooper but brown. Wooper's a decent design already. A uh, Palmy's okay. Again, the, like, th there's a lot of Pokemon that just to me just aren't really. Maybe it's because a lot of these are first form Pokemon. That's why I'm not vibing with a whole lot of them. But a lot of them are like, okay, it's kind of cute. It's kind of cool, but it's not like, whoa, that's sick. Like, like I remember when Gen 6 was uh, starting to like have all their Coral Coral leaks and stuff like that. There were a lot of Pokemon that I was like, oh, that's so cool. Like, whereas now it's like, okay, you know, that's all right. Like small of, you know, kind of silly, but okay. Wiglet. It's kind of dumb, I'm not going to lie. Wiglet's kind of stupid. <laughs> but other than that, like, those are all the Pokemon that have been officially revealed for Scarlet and Violet. And I will say, they have actually done a pretty good job of not spoiling everything. If you remember Omega Ruby and Alpha Sapphire? They revealed every Mega Evolution before the game came out. Sun and Moon, it was like every Pokemon line except like two. I think the only two, I, I can't remember what one of them was, but uh, the... Um, Oh my god, I forget its name now. See, I, I I deserve death. I can't remember a Pokemon's name. 
Um, the spider one wasn't revealed. The spider one with the with the bubble on its head. He wasn't revealed in like one other line for Sun and Moon, but like there's not a lot of Pokemon that have been revealed for Scarlet and Violet, and I do kind of think that's a good thing because while I have seen like some of the leaks here and there, I haven't seen the vast majority of them. And I'm looking forward to like jumping into the game and, and having that like, oh that's sick type uh, reaction to certain Pokemon. So so far, those are my thoughts on most of them. I'm pretty apathetic. I really like Seru Ledge. I really like uh, Grafifi. And Clough's pretty cool. All right? And, and Gimme Gold, g g the hate he gets is not warranted. He's kind of cute. I'm not going to lie. The Pokemon Go connectivity, though, that kind of sucks. But other than that, let me know what your guys' thoughts are on the Pokemon roster right now. Uh, are there any Pokemon you're particularly excited for? Again, we're, I'm not covering leaks on the channel. I don't want Nintendo down my throat, and I honestly don't want to essentially spoil the entire game for everyone before it comes out. So I know this is more of a casual styled video. When the game comes out, we're going to be doing a lot more like scripted guides, breakdowns, stuff like that. But we're keeping it chill today. So if you enjoyed, like and subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace.